The following recording is made possible by the American Muslims for Palestine Organization, Sacramento Valley Chapter. Visit us at www.ampalestine.org. A panel discussion on the Middle East. Presenting Dr. Hadam Bazian. Lecturer in the Department of Near East Studies and Adjunct Professor in Bolt School of Law at UC Berkeley. And Zeev Maz, Professor of Political Science at UC Davis. Reverend Timothy Malone, Pastor at the UC Davis Campus Ministry. Please enjoy. Now, I know that the Israelis 
responses of it is that we did this because of security. And we had to build the wall because of security. And that's logical enough. You could say that the Israelis felt insecure. But their insecurity, the basis of the insecurity is their continued belief that they could have an occupation and bring some group to manage the occupation for them. And this managing the occupation is in the guise of the Palestinian authority. Now, I don't want to go into extensive details of how the failures of the peace process, but let me speak specifically about the Hamas uh, confrontation with Israel at this particular time. The participation of the Hamas in the political process was a result of our own president wanting democracy to be brought to the Middle East. That it was President Bush that wanted democracy and wanted elections. And therefore, he pushed for the elections to be held in the Palestinian territories. Likewise, he actually pushed for Hamas to be included in the political process. Once again, it's from his perspective, and I think strategically you could say that as long as Hamas is outside the political process, the territory and the state does not really function well. As long as you're outside the rules of the game, you don't have to abide by the rules of the game. So the understanding is that we bring in Hamas, and if it participates in the election, right, and can be included in the process, we might be able to set up a concluding agreement with the Palestinian Authority, and that results in a demilitarized mini-state, and then we still don't know what the borders of the state, but to bring Hamas into the political process. Hamas did not expect to win. They didn't think that they would win the election. All indications that they would win maybe 38, maybe 40, maybe 42 percent. Fatah believed that they are going to win. And the U.S. thought that Fatah will win, and Abbas and his supporters will win. I said at the time they should have sent all the machines from Florida to guarantee <laughs> and possibly also get the Supreme Court involved. <laughs> Fatah got entered in. 